unusual spice should be old spice. So what we're going to do today is I just want to measure out and try cut for the upstand bit and see if we can fix that around here and uh, then get ourselves ready for potentially tiling and doing that bit. Yeah, so let's measure it, cut it, make sure it fits and glue it in. Bit of double sided sticky tape should do the job. Come on. Now this is where you sack the plasterer because yeah doesn't quite yeah I've, I've not done it flat and this and this piece of wood is a bit warped so that needs to sit there with a bit of weight on to bend it that way bend it in but if kind of we work on the basis that that's there that's there, fit that in, fit that in. That would be pretty cool, huh? Here we go, here we go, here we go. Monge two, monge two. Here we are, some of Little's finest, thing. Eh? Let's try, and might be able to get that one in, you see. My brown eyed girl. Ooh, my brown eyed girl. Do you remember when we used to sing? Sha la 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 ti da. Sha la 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 ti da. La ti da. La -da. Well, whilst I make a complete holix of this, um, I just wanted to give a big shout out to Kev. Kev, you've been with us from day one. You crazy loon. What are you doing? Hey, I think I need to start a therapy group for people that have been here since day one because you must be severely traumatized by now it, it's kind of an addiction that's not good for you i reckon but kev i tell you what really do appreciate you there mate thank you very much um i am making yeah a slow and painful 
balls up of all of this. But, you know, there's something strangely compelling about a slow motion car crash in there. What I've noticed is that I didn't seal this upstand that I've got here and it is split, it's got a bit wet and it's... Ugh. So, I can't do this bit at the back, which is a bit of a pain. So what I'm going to do, what am I going to do? What am I going to do? I'm going to have to order some more upstand. I want to... I've also... I've also the whole thing, you know, it a, came as a big, long piece of this stuff, didn't it? Um, on here, so it was a, a great big, long piece. And what it's done, you can see, you can see because you lean it up against something upright, it just, it bends in. And now every piece, every piece has now got a bit of a curve on it. And of course, it's the wrong way. It's curved the wrong way. The walls need it to be kind of convex, not concave. Or is it the other way around? No, I guess it just depends which way you're looking at it, isn't it? I've cut them to size, short one today, mercifully. I hear your pain, folks, so we're doing a short one. I've cut the bits. I'll just set them up. I'll just suspend it between something and put a brick on it or something just to to just kind of ease it into a slightly straighter, flatter shape. And then, and then we'll um, glue them in place, um, set them off, seal them up, and get it ready to do some tiling on top. When I look at it, it does, it's amazing how those little finishing touches make something look a little bit more finished. I guess that's why they call them finishing touches. It's not my strong point, but there you go. Now, actually, just whilst we're here and we sort of stood by the window, this bit here, which I think, I think was called the condensation calamity waiting to happen. Well, I think what I'll do there is I've got some of this, some of these uh, end panels in the gray. So what I might do is I might cut one to size and put it on the facing, Kind of as you look outside the facing so the back of the worktop because the worktop isn't sealed and it's it doesn't look great so i think i might just put that edging on it and then i might try i might put i've got my mind going now i might see if i can cut another piece of the end panel and have that as like a gray sit-in windowsill it will be below the surface of the worktop but it might look better that's a plan I've also got that end panel to do. Yeah, why am I giving myself jobs? Did you see my little sign? Hey, did you like it? What do you reckon, folks? And it comes to escape to the dream house. You got to dream big, folks. See you soon.